I want to demonstrate the peep on the ventilator screen for you and um, let's go quickly over things that we learned so far so the trigger on this patient is assist control as you see AC this particular breath is an assist breath the ventilator telling us using a flow the patient trigger is a flow trigger and the control trigger is a backup rate of 16 per minute and you can guess the ventilator uh, 60 divided by 16 almost 3 point I think 9 or something seconds I may be wrong but every um, uh, this is the time the ventilators will wait before it kicks in and give the backup rate all right this is the uh, FiO2 if you know this is uh, clearly a pressure target because see we provided the inspiratory pressure this is basically the target proximal airway pressure and the airway that's what we want the ventilator to deliver and the ventilator is fulfilling this I'll show you in a second how this is the PEEP the positive end expiratory pressure I want you to look here this is the proximal air the pressure circuit basically this is a proximal airway pressure and see th uh, during this the green is inspiration and the uh, yellow is expiration here this goes to 30 during inspiration and basically the ventilator start at 10 see the expiration start almost at 10 and this is the peep so the ventilator job during expiration is to maintain a proximal airway pressure of 10 or close to 10 as you see um, then during inspiration we'll add the 20 here that we asked to uh, ask the ventilator to do so the positive the proximal airway pressure will go from 10 to 30 because we added the 20 so this is a pressure target the flow by default and the pressure target as we explained before is a decelerating ramp and this is the green is inspiration and the expiration by default should be also decelerating ramp because again the flow and expiration depends on the gradient between the alveolar pressure and the proximal airway pressure and this diminish it doesn't stay the same it's not constant it will be high at the beginning and start diminishing that's why expiration uh, flow is like a decelerating ramp in reverse this is the time one second two second three seconds four second five seconds six seconds so see the pressure and flow are depicted against time as you see um, one more thing quickly to wrap up here is this is the actual respiratory rate the patient is breathing 32 per minute while the backup rate 16 so you know all this breath has to be assessed breaths and this is the IE ratio inspiration expiration ratio and it's mainly the ratio between inspiration time and expiration time and this is what am I what I am going to talk about during next video